Diphtheria is a serious infection caused by the toxin-producing Conibacterium diphtheriae, which affects the nose, throat, and sometimes the skin of an individual. People at risk of contracting diphtheria are children and adults who are unvaccinated or partially vaccinated with the diphtheria toxoid-containing vaccine, those who live in crowded environments and those who live in environments with poor sanitation, and also healthcare workers and people who come in contact with suspected or confirmed cases of diphtheria. Diphtheria is highly infectious and spreads easily through direct contact with infected people, through droplets from an infected person while coughing and sneezing, and also through contact with contaminated objects and clothing. The signs and symptoms of diphtheria occur two to 10 days after exposure. These include fever, runny nose, sore throat, cough, red eyes, neck swelling, and in severe cases, a white or gray patch occurs on the tonsils or at the back of the throat of an individual, causing difficulty breathing and also swallowing. The Nigeria Childhood Immunization Schedule recommends three doses of the pentavalent diphtheria toxoid containing vaccine for children in their 6th, 10th and 14th week of life. For children over four years, adults, pregnant women and during outbreaks, the TD vaccine is recommended for protection against diphtheria. Washing hands with soap and under running water is also advised. To reduce the risk of diphtheria, the NCBC recommends the following. Parents or guardians should ensure that their children have the three doses of the pentavalent vaccine as recommended in the Nigerian Childhood Immunization Schedule. Individuals with signs and symptoms suggestive of diphtheria should report to their healthcare facilities and or treatment centers for diagnosis and notification of local health authorities, NCDC and NPHCDA. Healthcare workers should remain vigilant, look out for symptoms of diphtheria, and notify the local government area, state disease surveillance and notification officer, or the NCDC, through the toll-free line 6232. Close contact with a confirmed case of diphtheria should be closely monitored, given antibiotic prophylaxis, and started on diphtheria antitoxin treatment when indicated. All healthcare workers, doctors, nurses, laboratory scientists, and support staff with a high level of exposure to diphtheria should be vaccinated.